Yo, what is up guys, C Gun Ruby 63 here with, uh, as you can see, Minecraft, I got my tuxedo skin here, you're probably wondering what the hell are you wearing, well this is iron uh, armor, but in a texture pack, I got my inventory full, i show you why in a second, so let me turn around, alright, this is what I've been busy today, I made this in one day only, I didn't take that much time on it, uh, let me actually just fly. So this is basically kind of a, like a modern house I was trying to build. I just decided to, well, have my imaginary go full attic, you know, just see what comes out of it. Pretty, well it looks pretty good I, th I guess. Some, some things I am like, uh, could have been better, but I think I'm, well, I think it's pretty good. What you can hear now is uh, the fireplace downstairs, but I'll show you guys that in a second. Just flying by here, we got the little, um, whatchamacallit, uh, I guess you could call it like creek or whatever you want to call it. Uh, so yeah, it goes like almost all the way um, around it. Well, I didn't do it completely because that would have been just too much, but it just gives a nice um, touch, you know. So right here we've got the fountain. Uh, which entrance should I take? Uh, I'm taking the left one. So I got two entrances. Uh, one here that leads to the kitchen, and uh, that one leads to the fireplace area, like the hangout area. So as you can see here, you walk in this uh, really high place. Let me actually close the doors. Really high place. It's about uh, actually like seven blocks high, I think. So let me see here, hold on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and in total 8. So it's like gigantic. Let me do it, do it like that. So yeah, we've got... Mm, let's see. <laughs> I need to think again. This is glass right here, just normal glass. And this right here are steps that I put uh, together just like figuring out what the best thing was and well, I guess that looked pretty good so I just kept that here we got the little kitchen area because like it's close to the door so you don't want to make like a kitchen island here you don't want to do that that messes up the whole place then you need to go around it when you enter it and ah so annoying so I just made this little one with the furnace workbench the fridge you know uh, so over here it's kind of weird but I'll show you in a second why so here's the dining area some of them have like uh, arm support things some of them don't if you want to get on the ones that have you need to first do them down and then up again it's kind of like weird but uh, I liked it that way so as you can see it only has like uh, one arm that actually connects to the ground the other one is just floating uh, am I able to get over there? Maybe. Yeah, as you can see, it's floating. Outside area right there. So let me just fix that. Alright. So over here we got carpet. That leads to uh, the places that is actually ported. Hold on. I actually need to fix something real quick. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that one. And this one. There we go. Fixed show you in a second why so first uh, the reason why the dining area is like this because upstairs we got a uh, barbecue area not that many seats though only two but I guess you don't really need the seats because downstairs there's another area where you can eat so I mean you don't really need that so I decided to use uh, quads slabs these are all slabs even though with the blocks they're still slabs so yeah and again with the table like up in the air and one side connecting to the ground at the other side so that is basically um, well the barbecue area it's not completely outside but still kind of outside here we have like um, well just nice little outstairs overlooking you know if you want to see whoever is coming to your house you can just overlook in this balcony let's uh, yeah, looks pretty nice. So over here we got some more carpet. Carpet. Damn it, my words. So this is cyan wool, I think. Cyan carpet wool. So, uh, so something like that. So over here is one of the areas that I 
well, kind of worked on, not that much, but yeah. As you can see here, there's the water from, um, well, the outside area. Picture here, I guess it's kind of a television, because right here you have sitting area. So all around here is just fire. You're probably wondering why the ice isn't melting and the, f and the wood isn't uh, burning. Because I have a mod installed that um, well basically prevents the ice from melting and the wood from burning. So yeah, kind of useful, you know, especially in these kind of situations. You don't want the ice to melt, you don't want the woods to the logs to burn. Bada bing, bada boom, that's your solution. Mods. So over here, this is uh, should I use this one right now? Yeah, this is actually one of the last ones. So first up. We're going all the way to the end. As you can see, this is a nice nature um, area, I guess you could call it. So we got a tree here, a custom tree. Because for some reason, the normal tree wouldn't grow. Don't ask me why, it's just... Yeah, weird, because there should be enough like space for it to grow. So the graph was actually the pathway that goes... Or pathway, whatever you want to pronounce it. So that goes all the way around. So here's like area that you can actually do anything you want on. And over here we got like the corner couch from stone. So that is kind of yeah, not really um, useful. So yeah. And uh, well, over here we got doors to the outside. Outside I'll show you guys later. So here we got these nature blocks just going down with the leaves. It's not completely done as you can see the leaves are still growing down. But when they when they are completely done it looks it looks pretty good. So over here, let me just go from this area right here. So here we got like a little balcony of looking the flat land because well it's easier that way to build a massive house like this. So as you can see you got this like little bridge thingy that goes over here and then over here and then this right here is like a nice little balcony overlooking the n uh, the nature uh, area, I guess you could call it. And of course, a lot of sun sun areas, because well, I wanted that just to make it like really bright when uh, the sun is there. You don't have to use much light light blocks and stuff like that in it. So yeah. I did use some torches up there because when it gets dark then yeah. So out here, let me close the door real quick. Is uh, the swimming pool? As you can see here, it goes up and it's only like uh, one and a half blocks deep. So you, well, don't actually need to press space bar to keep like breathing, but you just like swim around like this. Because if I go, hold on game mode zero just to prove survival mode as you can see and everything is just fine well you should know that by now but yeah down there there are some uh, light blocks and I tell you this place looks amazing in the dark looks absolutely amazing especially the pool so for um, actually I should show you where run 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 don't trample on any of the weeds so the um, support blocks over here that I use for uh, well the thingy are um, well spruce woods and uh, just I think they are stone slabs yeah and I actually tried to do something with the wool uh, carpet carpet over here try to make it look uh, like a little bit more and I think it looked pretty cool so that's why I kept it there, just like a little touch that gives it to it. It looks pretty cool. Uh, over here we got like um, the little whatchamacallit over the entrance. So when you need to like unlock your doors you can just stand under here and not get wet. Yeah, my imagination went completely bananas on this house, I'll tell you that. I mean, it looks pretty cool I guess. It looks, it looks decent, let's just keep it on that. Alright, and the main thing why I actually made this house and this video is that I want to talk about um, about something that I would like to do, or actually I am going to do, is like, um, I have a world, well actually I'm going to make a new world, 
I'm gonna make uh, like a real village on that and I'm gonna make let's build houses and stuff like that like um small houses like cottage uh, things and well these giant mansions stuff like that maybe an underground house who knows so that will be coming up pretty soon but I first need to prepare the world and everything so yeah even some uh, survival houses just gathering up the stuff so you get could actually see that uh, you're able to make it in survival so I'll be making that in next week uh, I think no actually this week and uh, this week like maybe one or two episodes I'm not sure because next week uh, I think I'm, I'll be on vacation in Croatia if you don't know where that is look it up on Google it's close to Italy not really close but pretty close so um, yeah I'll be there for like one and a half week to two weeks so I'll, I would be there for quite some time so just a little heads up oh leg spike oh damn my computer is running so something for some reason don't know what because everything is pretty much off except Facebook and stuff like that you know the basic stuff so oh the sun is actually setting so I actually want to show you guys the house when it's like dark because my god the pool looks amazing then and the whole building actually well not really the roof because there's not so much lighting on it you know so I actually was going to make like a stable with it but uh, yeah the house alone is just gigantic so I mean don't need that I don't need it you know so the sun is setting and while the sun is setting everything gets its looks and everything starts to get like really well it just looks way better when it starts to get dark for some reason there's the moon and for you guys that want to uh, know what texture pack I'm using it's um, flows HD it's a pretty good texture pack as you can see it looks even better with the shader mod but if I have the shader mod installed I get like one or two frames no jokes I really get that so I mean no, not doing share this mod. If I could, I would, but I, yeah, my computer is just not able to handle it. You know, it's just like, oh nope, nope, not doing this, nope. Just, uh, just turning your cl whole computer off. That's basically what happens. So yeah, it's not completely dark yet. Come on, son, S settle down over there. Come on, come on. All right, let's go to game mode one there we go so yeah that is basically it that I wanted to talk about in this video and well wanted to show you this house because well it took me a while to make but I'm pretty proud of it so just leave in the comment sections below what you want to see in the let's build series what kind of houses don't make it too hard on me please because well I'm only like I'm not really pro at it but I do my best you know I do my best so yeah guys, I'll see you guys later in the Let's Build series and that was it for now, so peace out.